Welcome to the Empire Blade, this is Rampage, and welcome back to my Austria-Hungary campaign for the Great Wall mod, where we're going to continue where we left off from last time. Right now, we're trying to defend against a lot of Russians, as uh, they're trying to push into Lemberg here. We've got 2,700 guys, they've got a lot. I think what we're going to be trying to do is... I'm going to try and look for a position that is going to be e useful for me to kind of pull back to and try and defend. My hope is... I want to try and use my artillery pieces to try and break their artillery pieces. But I want to try and make sure that they always have to walk into range of my artillery first. instead, So that I can try and hit them and kill those guys off. Because right now, um, let's see, terrain wise, we want to be up on a hill. And we want to try and make sure we're in an area where we're not going to be shooting the ground accidentally. So we don't waste ammo. Um, I think, oh, over here, there's a bit of a hill. So I would say, so I think right, because what I kind of want to do is I'm thinking about having my artillery pieces, let's say like maybe here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this a little bit differently than I've been done before, it's so like you guys there, then one of my infantry units here, because I want to make sure you guys, because I'm trying to make sure that my units will be as far away from the enemy as possible that they want to actually advance over to us. But I have to make sure that um, they don't just freely shoot my infantry or something. So I'll have it so you there, then like another one here, and kind of keep repeating this pattern across this area so that also my artillery is more spread out. This way, I can try and have it so that they have to walk over to me to get to my artillery pieces. This way, I think we can kind of have like just a, a really big kill box, basically, is what I'm trying to do here. This way, they have to walk close to my artillery to actually do some damage to me. So let's kind of go here, here, and here. And then, for the most part, all the other uh, units I have, I'm just going to have you guys in a group for now so I can make sure I see who I've used so far. Everybody else will say, I've got about four guys each, so I can put about four of you guys here. And then I'll have the other four, you'll be up on this spot as soon as I can adjust you. And basically, we're just trying to wait for them to advance for us, over to us. My Cav and my General, chill back here. You're useless until I soften them up a little bit more. General, you're supposed to move over here too. Um, so we'll try this, because I don't think I can do much to their forces to try and... Because I, I, I could try and almost like advance and rush their forces first. But I think this way I can have a lot of artillery fire. Some of you guys can't hit just yet, but that's okay. It means that we can kind of have them. We can kind of stagger their forces in. Hopefully this means that if like one artillery piece is under fire, they can't hit all my artillery pieces. I think this might work. We've got a really big kill box and we're just going to try and hold this spot. If I can, I would love to be able to try and like just focus down their dudes as they're making their way onto the map, but I don't think that's going to be a possibility right now. So we have to sit here, wait, and see how this goes. This is working so far. Bounce power is still shifting back towards the enemies right now, but we have killed quite a few forces so far. I'm waiting until my cav... Uh, I'm trying to wait a little bit longer with my cav. As at the moment, they keep trying to shoot them as soon as I try and move forward. Um, actually, one of their artillery pieces here is getting really close. So I might be able to kill one of them off as soon as they just walk into melee with me. We got a couple more infantry units that are making their way here. I can't hit these guys with how I'm currently set up. This area I just can't touch right now. I hate that this artillery piece is almost dead. You guys, oh, you're just inoperable now. That's great. Uh, shit. Okay, well, at least these areas are still holding. We have wasted about 10 minutes of the battle. If we can waste another 50, we will at least hold for today. I think we're just about to enter the final stretches of this battle, as they are now rushing us with their cav, and now I might have the opportunity, maybe, to rush this area. My artillery is taking a beating. We're still killing a lot of them. I, we're still holding. Like, I've got a bit of ammo left still. My cav, I'm, I'm waiting. I'm trying to wait until the best time to use you. As right now, I know you guys will be slaughtered if I try and throw you up this way. And so I'll just kind of wait. Honestly, I might just start helping having you guys help out with the infantry here. Because if we can have you just charge the infantry, that will break them. And then we can save a bit of our ammo. But I don't know if that's gonna if you're really gonna survive those charges. So right now, you guys are holding, you're fine. Battle timer. Um, let's see, we've got 
about 40 minutes left of the battle. If we can just hold for that duration, we will win and survive. And I'm just trying to survive. That's my only goal. I think now's the time to start using my cap. I'm gonna start rushing you guys up in here. I need to start killing these infantrymen as we are now really low on ammo with a lot of my guys. You guys are just taking a beating from this though, which sucks. Keep pushing forward, keep just shooting these guys as you can. You need to try and kill them off and just wait a little bit longer. We've wasted about 33 minutes of the battle time. No, there's 33 minutes left. We can just hold out a little bit longer. We might still be able to do this. Oh my god, I hate how worthless my cap is. Like, you guys are doing nothing. You're just getting shredded here. And I hate that I'm not even, like, wasting the enemy's ammunition. As you guys are just getting destroyed here. Like, you'll maybe at least kill this one unit and break them. But, oh, my cab is dead. Ah, uh, I was trying to save All you for a one running. final glorious moment. And you guys are just getting destroyed. Well, we've hit that point of desperation. My men are fixing bayonets. I've got two units with ammo still. You're trying to kill this artillery piece if you can because I don't know if we can last much longer they are oh, absolutely are destroying us I'm trying to have my general on the way back and see if maybe he can survive for the entire duration but 26 minutes they could rush me at any point right now and absolutely destroy me but I'm gonna try we'll, we'll keep trying to stay back lure them out and if they just keep coming in one by one I can do something but I just don't know if I can do something for 20 minutes Nope, they finally decided, hey, let's just rush on in them. Because now we're going to die. So we killed a lot. My All guys are just running. running. We did well. We tried. We did a lot of damage. But given the amount of artillery pieces they had, and my cab fucking suck, I couldn't do anything to that. So we killed 2,900 guys. We did kill more than we lost, which sucks. And we are going to lose this place. My artillery piece has got a lot of kills, but it just wasn't enough. It just wasn't enough. So they are going to take this now. And I'm going to have to hope, really hope, they don't keep pushing in on me right now. <laughs> Looks like they're going to, though. Ah, oh, please don't. As right now, I'm already trying to deal with Italy. My, my one hope is right now. It should take Russia a decently long time, I hope. Because it did take it take me a while, too. To walk into my lands, actually. It'll take them a while to just walk on over there to get into our lands. So maybe I can push into Italy a little bit. Like, if I can get into Venezia And then pull my forces back. I don't need both those armies there. But I just want to try and have both push in there. Take that bit of land. One thing, though, that I'm kind of hopeful for, maybe, is I might actually start making money now. That was a big army, and that city did not make me a ton, um, from what I remember. And so I might actually be turning a profit this turn. I'm going to hope so, because that's the one silver lining I can think of for that assault there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I have so much more money now. Because this place, I can't look at it now. Oh, yeah, it made like 600, and I had a full stack army there. If anything else, you guys are taking attrition while you're making your way over this way. Because what I'm hoping is, please don't walk down this way. Please, if anything, kind of go around this way. Because I'm gonna have to, I have to get a force back over there at some point. But for right now, let's take advantage of the fact that hey, I've got some money. I can build some stuff. I can actually improve my fucking economy. Like you guys keep upgrading all of those. I have a lot of these I can build all over the place, and I just need to improve my economy. Like you guys there as well. Also, infrastructure. We need some fucking railroads because we need to have faster movement around our lands. Because we have fucking none. So let's grab those, those, and those. Um, we are making... Yeah, we're making 4,300 for right now. I am going to be trying to have... Like, it's you guys here. I've got this force. That might not be enough to push in there right now. Um, I can start recruiting some more guys here. It's going to take a little while. And then... You guys, like, walked on... Like, you were, like, somewhere around here. You tried to go into my city. I just go into it again. I don't want to exempt you guys from tax. Trying to get rid of these guys and finish them off. Best we can. Belgium's dead. Nice. Intellectual adva advancement. Nice. Okay, that's what we want. I don't care about that. Oh, that was Austria again. Christmas truce. Yeah, we're not... They're not abiding by that. So you guys rebelled a little bit. Did they destroy anything? I hope they didn't. Oh, this is still... Oh, I need to repair that. I need to repair that as soon as I can. Actually, I'll probably do next turn. 
Now, they did destroy it. They did damage a factory. But I actually have some money so I can repair that. Um, I do need to change my research because, no, stop this. That makes that pisses people off. No, stop that. Let's see, I can get that for some more money. Administrative cost, morale, and land battles. One thing I definitely need to make sure I get... Um, Clamor for reform. That would not be bad. Plus one happiness for across the board. That takes five turns. Because reducing upkeep would be nice. Getting some better artillery would be good too. Because uh, what could I actually recruit for your artillery? Because that's the one thing I hate about losing that one army. So I've got some mountain guns, light howitzers, or field guns. Those are recruitable around my capital at least. So that is something. Um, I think what I want to switch over to is... It'll take a while to get the airplane one. So that's not something we can do. Um, why is that not bad? Is it just because I have to get the mass production one first? Doesn't specify what I need. Besides, I'm just assuming just getting mass production, which <sighs> increases unhappiness, so I can't grab that right now. I think... Bonus to artillery accuracy. Ooh. That would be useful. That does nothing. Um... The research rate would not be bad. Command. Command ships. Unlocks those units. Unlocks mortars. What's the range on mortars? Heavy mortars. You guys have a range of 1,000. 550. What do these guys have for a range? 800. Oh. Yeah, those guys are 800. I think I might grab that. The Heavy Mortars has a range of a 1,000. That is pretty nice. Anything with a longer range I need. Otherwise, I think I might just get this. More happiness. Didn't know we'll have the administration costs, but we can get this shelter there. Actually, <laughs> administration wouldn't be bad. I think... Let's get the War Bonds. We need some money. I don't care about this. I don't want that, because it's going to make things even worse for us, as that unhappiness is already kicking our ass. Building constructed, we did finish that. Just don't know where the hell that one little army went around here, because I need to stop sitting around here defending the city. Oh no, my king died! No! Ah, we already lost our Archduke, now we have to lose our king too? Okay, now I did see, uh, during the end turn, I saw the Serbian army run this way. So I'm going to try and see if I can go find them and kill them. Um, oh, I actually do have my agent, so let's have you maybe see if you can find them. I don't know if you actually will be able to, but we'll try. Because I need to figure out where these little bastards are. Um, let's also make sure we repair that. And then there was this factory over here. Repair that. And then right now, um, will that be able to get... That would not be able to get heavy artillery. What about this one? This one would be able to. Um, there's already the minus one from this, so that wouldn't be too much of an issue. Let's get the extended artillery factory. Grab that. Then basically what I can do is after we finish this, we can go for the artillery one. Get the uh, heavy... Oh, the siege gun? No, that's not, that's not the, this one. Get the uh, re-implementation of the mortar. Try and get some better mortars for our forces. Um, Austria, I need you to start trying to recruit some troops around here. I need... Let's see, which ones are the cheap ones? Royal Austria... Ooh, those guys are pretty cheap. Because basically... You guys are not bad. They take three turns. There's not that many of them, though, is the thing. These guys are pretty good. They take four turns, though. Um, I think we go with these guys. Try and get a couple of them. We just slowly get a full stack around here. Then we'll start making our way over to try and advance into Italy. I now have Carlo the First as my new national leader. Good. We will welcome him here. Also, what can I get? Let's see. I probably have to want to try and get that. If I can get the press censorship. So I can get some more representation around here. Because that's the main issue right now. Is you guys are just so pissed off. I can't do much because of the anger with my faction. Like, at least here, we'll be able to have some more money going into the uh, economy a little bit with these finishing up. I should have... Yeah, next turn, I'll finish up a couple of those. And like, what was it? Like, three of them I was recruiting building? At least two. At least two of them. No, yeah, three. So that's another 600 per turn. And that will also give us just some more wealth per turn. And also, chance for more agents, which would be nice. Yeah, those little bastards just keep running this way. So I know they're around here. I just don't think I can just see them with this guy. So it's just kind of sad. Um, so I'll keep having you guys kind of try and make your way over here. I'm hoping that... Because every turn, this does go down. So hopefully, it'll go down enough as I keep trying to chase these little bastards down. Uh, you guys here, 
keep getting some more infantry and then Austria. Let's see. So you've got one guy there. We are down seven units. Um, I still can't move out any of these guys, correct? No, actually I can. I can move them out right now. So I will bring you guys down this way. That way we're only down three units. It'll be two after this guy. So let's try and just recruit um, a couple more of you guys. I could get another artillery piece. That takes three turns, though. I think we'll kind of hold off on that for now. I think that's okay. Grab, just grab four units. Just grab those guys, and then I can upgrade this. That'll give me another 150. Let's grab that. That will be repaired in four turns. You guys, let's see. That does give more representation for these guys and gives a little bit more regional tax. Um, otherwise, this does just give another straight up 100, which might not be the worst to grab right now. So let's grab that there. Um, I do need to make sure that I'm actually building... I have railroads. Okay, let's focus on that first. So you guys over here... Um, actually cancel that building. Cancel that for now. I'd actually rather get better infrastructure. Because right now our units are so fucking slow. And I need to improve that. So I think right now... It's just this one over here. I need to get one over here as well. Thankfully Russia has not been doing much. They're not advancing on us just yet, which is good. I need to buy as much time as I can before I start trying to focus on them once more. As I, I, I really need to take advantage of the fact I have money right now. I actually have money. So we need to use that to the best we can right now to develop our regions as much as possible. Like this area here, I should actually try and maybe upgrade that at some point. Because that will let me recruit better units. Yeah, it doesn't look a couple more. Because that's the main thing, is that it takes so long sometimes to recruit units. Okay, so let's see. So you guys right here, right now, it'll be one more turn until you guys finish that unit. You'll have four more guys right here. Um, Austria is still doing well. Basically, you'll have plenty of extra troops around here next turn. Oh, okay, damn, I thought we had a new agent, sadly, but nope, that's not the case. Okay, so right now, let's see, what does Italy got right now around here? They actually don't have much, so I think right now, I can have you guys... Grab these dudes. Group them up. It is a little lower than I would like, but hey, we can start advancing over this way next turn. I think we can just kind of wait. It'll take us about two, three turns to get over there. We need to kind of push in there and maybe a checkpoint. Oh, choke point. Um, finally, can I kill you guys? <laughs> Although if I do, you guys might just rebel immediately. They're not going to fight us. Because this area, it is going down. Yeah, it's going down one per turn. Oh my god, it's going to take 16 turns until it's away. Oh, that's so painful. That is so fucking painful. Also, another thing I want to be doing while I am getting all this surplus of money is upgrading these. That gives me another 100 per uh, town. So let's keep upgrading you guys there. I can't upgrade that right now. That's repairing still there. And then I have just enough. Uh, there was the one of the city that I can actually get some more infrastructure. So you guys right here, give me the single track. Because that will also give us more per turn, and then also just more uh, re just movement speed. Which, that is the worst thing about this mod, is things are so slow. So, right now at least, um, you guys finally repaired that. Oh, that's why it wasn't working, because I was having you research that. Okay, yeah, you focus on that, because that will give plus two per turn wealth in all my regions. That is very useful. And also, again, better infrastructure. Oh, I need that. Oh, I desperately need that. I wish I could tell how much it improves the rate of movement, but I don't know. I have no idea. But I think there's up to like three or four levels of that, if I remember correctly. So we'll keep researching that for now. Um, raid on the Suez Canal. Interesting. You guys recruited. Enemy army withdraws. Yeah, that was just down here. Again, thankfully Russia is not really doing anything up here. I'm hoping that that stays like that for now. Because... I'm going to take the blessing I was given with them uh, taking that army out and build up my economy as much as I possibly can. I am still trying to subjugate Serbia right now, which is taking for fucking ever. I'm hoping that as we get more research, it will be a bit easier for us to do that. Otherwise, I don't know how I'm finishing this campaign in the time limit they give. Technically, we started on... Um, I can't remember which month... I don't remember what month this mo the mod started on, but there's 52 weeks per year, and we only have until 1918. Uh, oh god, there are two stacks of uh, Italians over there. Jesus! Mm, I might be able to push in there just yet. I do, I'm really hoping they don't do what they just did with Russia over there. That would suck. Um, I should actually check right now. Oh, hello! 
I get to intercept you, bastards! Yes, let's do that so I can... I'm gonna minimize my casualties. I wanna fight this myself, minimize my casualties. Um, as I know they have no artillery, so we'll absolutely slaughter them. But, I just wanna minimize casualties right now. These guys will be dead. Hopefully, Serbia is gonna then be pacified, because I would love to be able to send this army west. Actually, not even just directly west. I want to send them onto one of my boats and have them hit Italy. That's what I want to do. Because that'd be perfect. If we could actually have it so that we can just drop off and attack Italy, that'd be awesome. Because then we could actually do some decent damage to their economy and hopefully kind of break their forces away from where they are currently at. As we saw what happened with us fighting two armies with Russia. It... We can do a lot of damage, but if they have too many artillery pieces, I'm not going to be able to do anything against them. I'll be able to kill a lot, but I will not be able to win, which is the thing that sucks the most about that right now, honestly. So let's destroy the remnants of the Serbian revolutionaries, and hopefully this will crush their spirits into thinking they can ever stand up to our empire ever again. You guys got, like, just a few pity kills, it feels like, at this point. Because a couple of their cab units almost got into melee range with us. You guys are slaughtered. You guys are slaughtered. There's this one cab unit left here that's still trying. Also, I'm trying to remember if there's a way to increase the amount of ammunition I have on units. Or if that's just tied to the tier level of the units. I'm not sure, actually. I should look at that more closely with my units um, next time I'm looking at that. Because these units go through so much ammo. Like, that was a tiny little army. And we went through a shit ton of ammunition on some of my units. And so I'm hoping we can increase our ammunition supplies at some point. Oh good, I actually kind of didn't kill them just yet. Because one thing I'm kind of tempted to try and do is up here. Um, let's see, which one's the cheapest again? Actually, I thought I saw 104. Yeah, 104. So I think you guys... Also, ammunition 45. 60, okay, you guys have 65. So there are some units that have more ammunition. You guys have 35, 35. Okay. I'm going to try and recruit two of these units. Hopefully, them watching over the city will be enough to make it so that they will... Also, I'm not even making that much money. It doesn't even help with public order all that much, though. So I'll just keep it as, as it is. Because I want to finish you guys off, but I'm worried that you'll just rebel again. Let's do it. Finish you guys off here. Get rid of them. I would... Really, I would not have lost 51 guys. Okay, because those guys are now dead. Serbia is... It's better. It is better. Military crackdown of five. It's still going down only one per turn there. I'm going to hope that maybe they'll stop. That's my hope. Because um, what I think I'm going to do is let's bring you guys back up here. Push them out. And I could try and hit Napoli. I could hit try and Naples. I could try and do that. Or, I feel like I might need to make my way on up here, as they've got quite a few dudes. They've got quite a few dudes around there. You're, you're gonna sit, you're gonna wait. You are waiting until I can get to you with some more guys. And then that's the thing I should keep in mind, is the units I'm grabbing. How much ammo do they have? Like, you guys have 100, uh, yeah, I'll take you two turns, but yeah, grab those guys. They've got 45 ammo. Um, this unit is, this is still trying to repair. And then, let's see, you guys here. I've got 2,000 gold right now. 2,000, um, let's see. Ooh, you guys, um, let's see. Warehouse, factories, or large town. I would honestly probably just say large town. Maybe grab that. Is there anything else I want to grab right now? Oh, no, you guys can get something here. That farm collective, it's already got, this will just give me some more upkeep production. Definitely grab that. Um, we don't have a lot right now. I can get this. Get some more representation. Can I do that over here? Because that's a medium barracks. I almost wish I could convert that, but I sadly can't. Because you guys are just really pissed off here. Okay, well, that's what that's all we can do with you guys, then. I don't think I have enough money for anything else besides building up, like, one of these, which I'll try and do that. Try and grab that. And then you guys here will just be four turns until you will try and head out. I'm gonna, I want to try and have this guy head out and help you out. Because I'm hoping that maybe if you guys here have those two units, this area will be happy and I can leave it and I don't have to focus here. Because I need to push into Italy right now. I can't do anything against Russia, but Italy, I can do something. Okay, we finished some research. We got the war bonds. That should actually help out a little bit more with our money. Again, I need to stop that with those guys. So, so you guys are asking... 
It's just to reach dangerous levels. Damn it, they're just gonna rebel again. Okay, because what I think we'll do... Because they're getting better, but still, they're just gonna riot again. Make your way back up there. I'm gonna hope I get there in time. We will get those two units, but they might still break. So, what's going on right here right now is Italy is pushing forward. I am going to... Let's see. Oh, you guys can't get there in time. Damn it. I was hoping you guys might be able to. Because... This force here, let's see, my spy, I need to see what's in that army. Because I feel like I should assault you guys. I only got a 33% chance to infiltrate that force. Come on, move on up, guys. We're going to try and see what's in this army. Uh, you failed. They do have some mortars and stuff. Stop. We're a little low on troops in comparison. They've got two more than us, but... I think it's better for us to be aggressive and attack this force right now, as opposed to wait. So, let's push in here. Oh my god! What the hell is that? So you've... You've eight pieces of artillery. Okay. Um, if I can advance onto you quickly, I will kill them all. But, oh god. That, I, 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 do you remember? Artillery does break the auto-resolve. From what I remember last time when I played this, an army of all artillery can slaughter. So, if you fight it, it's a little bit different. It is, as it, it's just like that because they have unlimited ammo. Oh god. Okay, we're gonna have to rush. We're gonna have to rush them. Because most of their army is straight up just artillery pieces. So, I have to have it with my cav. Uh, you guys go over here. Like, the balance part, yeah. Like, in-game in right now, it's a little bit better. Let's have you guys kind of start rushing. It's at least a very mountainous region. So, that makes it really good for us. Actually, it doesn't, because they're mortars. But, no, let's just keep... Let's just rush them. We need to rush on up here immediately. I'm going to hope this isn't just going to murder my entire army. As it should be possible for us to beat this. It should. So you guys need to kind of push on up here, split on up into little groups. Cav, you guys also kind of try and make your way on over here. Just start advancing as best you can. We need to get to those artillery pieces. Because again, they don't have that many infantry units. But they have so many mortars. Oh, so many mortars, my god. As here we go, first contact with my infantry, my artillery. I'm trying to get you guys back here, as it's more important for us to get rid of those artillery pieces of theirs. Also, if we can kind of direct them to, like, focus on my Ara Calf, that's better than them focusing on my infantry. Although, actually, you guys... Try and charge this unit, please. Try and charge that unit. Like, these guys are gonna die here. We've actually got the high ground here, too. Uh, you guys here, yeah, you're slaughtering them there. These guys are in position. You guys need to move up a little bit more. Kind of start rushing in through this city. Kind of go there, my guys. Oh, I actually just gave you the wrong order. Yeah, push on up that way. This unit is dying. There you go. You guys. Ah, and this is a great spot. You guys just. One of you just line up. Oh, if I can do this right. Yeah, line up there. You guys kind of go around this way. This unit, this unit is dying. This is a little bit of a precarious spot, but we should be okay. We're slaughtering them there. Cap, how you guys doing? You've killed that one unit. Now get the hell out of there, and we'll try and hit another one of them. How's the infantry up here? Like, you guys are dying. I need one of you guys to try and almost to get over here if I can. But I'm going to try and focus on their in, uh, infantry first. As soon as they're all dead, we can easily just start focusing on just the artillery pieces. Like, those guys are all dead. And you guys... I'm going to have you two. Kind of just here. And you guys try and make your way on up here. Yeah, balance power is definitely now shifting in my favor. You guys kind of try and run over here. My cat's so good. My cab is worthless. I can't wait to get rid of this. I really can't. Like, I can't wait for tanks. I, I can't remember how long it takes me to get them. Uh, like, how far down they are on the research tree. But, oh, I'm so excited for when I can finally get them. That's the general, and some of their mortars are just sitting here, too. What the fuck? Uh, let's try and move you guys a little bit more into the city a little bit. Kind of go there. Uh, you guys try and make your way on over here for that cat artillery unit. These guys almost in position. You can start opening up on those cab units. Kind of go like right there, actually. 
right there. Uh, you make your way down here with these guys. As now we need to kind of start shooting. We actually have to start making our way over to those cab units because all of these guys are broken for the most part. Like you guys, I'll start adjusting you guys a little bit more forward. They've got all these mortar batteries are just walking straight towards me. Uh, you guys should be able to kill the general in a second here. You should be able to hit him from there. Yeah, bounce power is now almost entirely my favorite. Yeah, so I have to make sure that I keep in mind that the artillery running, definitely breaks the auto-resolve. I need to make sure I... <laughs> Last time I played, I made an army straight just full of artillery. It was kind of hilarious as it broke the game, but I really shouldn't do that for this game, this playthrough. It would save me... But well, we're going to try and fight this more realistically with a bunch of infantry and uh, cav and artillery. Not cav. Cav. Um, artillery tanks and uh, infantry. The good old-fashioned World War I. You guys can move on up. It's just the cav now at this point, basically. Because you've been able to get rid of them there. Hopefully we're able to replenish a decent amount of guys in the city as I will be pulling back. Kind of... Just wanted to advance on these guys as soon as I could right now, as I think this was a better idea to go on the offensive. I should have done that with Russia, honestly. Try and focus down one army at a our time, running, then pull back to the city, but hindsight's 2020. We'll have to just deal with our uh, bad decisions. There we go. So at least got a heroic victory there. Now, how did we do? We lost 700 guys, they lost 2,000. Not bad. My calf somehow is still alive. Somehow. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to pull back. I almost want to finish them off, but no. We'll pull back towards as I grab. We want to try and just replenish our forces as best as we can. I honestly really just need to get rid of my calf at some point, really. Um, let's see. You guys here. Now, let's see. You guys are recruiting some stuff there. Can't upgrade that or that. You guys. Ooh. Okay. So I can get the local bank. Um, or I can get the shopping center. Um, oh, this one actually I can't get yet. I need mass production for that. That's, mm, it's mass production reduces happiness. I hate that. I'm just going to go with the local bank. Get gives me another 200 per turn. Gives a happiness to the upper class. Not bad. We can grab that. You guys here. I think I am just going to go with the large town. Go with that. And then I think um, you guys here, let's see, where's the 120? Yeah, it's like the best basic infantry unit I can recruit right now. So let's just start recruiting another one there. You guys can kind of do that. Please don't rebel. I need to get back here and hopefully you guys just don't rebel and take the city. Because I know if they do, I'm just going to have to restart the conquest, the resistance to foreign occupation, if they were break the if they break and take the city again. Okay, so we finally finished some research. This was the rail centralization. Nice. So now, um, yeah, there's reached dangerous levels. That was the college. Stop! Stop burning the college. Like they know they just finished that, um, and they're going for the re. Yeah, we'll have them stay on that one because I'll give us some more research rates. Um, I forgot to change you guys. Stop that. Stop trying to do mass mobilization. You're going to piss everybody off. Um, I need more happiness. So let's do that. Self-determination. Let's grab that first. And then now that I've finished that, I can actually get these guys. So let us start doing that around here first. I can build one of them right now. Not the best, but it's something. And then Italy's... Ooh, Italy's running away. Ooh, I like that. Yeah, let's finish these guys off then. If they're going to run away, let's finish you guys off. Kill them. And then we can keep pushing forward afterwards. There we go. And then kind of just pull on back. You guys have another troop there. Next turn, I'll have... Or, sorry, two more turns, and then that will be a full stack army. And if I can lure that one full stack army of Italy out again, I can take them out. And honestly... Honestly, pardon me. These things are so expensive, and they're fucking worthless. I'm just going to disband all of you bastards. You do nothing. And then I'm just going to bring uh, three units over this way. Replace. It's easier. It's better to have just infantry as opposed to cav, honestly. So just do that. Um, you guys here, I'm going to get the better expanded artillery, because I don't have enough money. I could just save the money, actually. Because this gives me a 1.5... Let's see, it gives... 
Increases trade values, trade routes, possible land, and it does improve movement speed. I just don't know how much it improves. I would hope that it doubles the speed as opposed to what it is currently, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Wouldn't even be all that much, honestly. Um, and how are you guys doing with those two units in there? If I exempt you from tax, it's almost good enough. So I could exempt you guys from tax for a little bit. I'm going to try it. I'm still expecting them to just revolt and start another rebellion. But we'll try it. I am making enough money where I can exempt them from tax for now. So let's try that. As I need them to stop being so pissed off. Yep, there's a rebellion. Ah, okay, it's... Yep, yeah, it's, it's a pretty large rebellion again. Uh, I have to hope you guys don't take the city this time. But, like, you need to push through these guys. This force right here is pitiful. They're gonna run. Try and keep chasing them down. There you go. So let's kill these guys off. Just gonna do an auto-resolve with that. And then... Let's hope you have enough time to get there. These guys can't get there in one turn. They can't get here in one turn. Good. So we should have enough time to get over there and actually reinforce... Awesome. That's what I need. Uh, Italy, how the f What the fuck? How did you get there? Okay. Uh, I'm going to go back to my city. Regroup, as I don't know where the hell these Italians came from. Where, How they got over here so quickly. They literally just teleported. Um, okay. Uh, as soon as my guys are all together, we're going to try and go to that force. I just don't know what the hell's going on there. But, okay, let's go around again and keep upgrading these. Keep trying to get all these started, as they do take oh, quite a while. It takes seven turns per, so I can get one to two of them built up per turn right now. At about one and a half, um, depending on how much money I have left over from previous assaults. So, hopefully that will start improving my economy and movement speed. That's the main issue, is just movement speed around here. So, I'll have to get you guys there next turn. But, you know... Don't know what happened with you guys. I need to regroup, and then we can take this force out. As they've got quite a few pieces of artillery there, I should be able to beat them with what I have right now, hopefully. Although, I think right now, actually, can I... I'm gonna, I'm gonna start re recruiting a couple more pieces of artillery. I need some more, as having only two pieces of artillery isn't the best right now with my forces. Also, I turned off watching, looking at um, army movements, as it takes so long with, uh, like, Germany. They move their armies all over the damn place. And so it's a little bit more difficult to keep an eye on where the hell they're going with some of these units. They're just sitting there, thankfully. Okay, so I can advance onto that Italian army right now. I was kind of hoping you guys would just sit there. Again, I don't know how they got past me and they just moved all the way around. They might have moved when I attacked that smaller force of theirs. Possibly. That's my maybe what they did. Um, Angels of Mons. Oh. Okay, then. Again, I will kind of just scroll through this slowly if anybody wants to pause it and read it for themselves. But I will not right now. Um, finish some construction report there. Units recruited. So we've got two fights here. You guys here can get back over to the city right now. Um, you can't actually get into it right now. That's okay. Oh, actually, wait. No, this is actually a problem. Uh, you guys get out because you need to be the reinforcements. You need to be in the settlement. Also, I'm going to stop exempting you guys from tax at this point now. And then, next turn, because I will have enough movement then. Um, well, actually, I can move out a little bit further. Because I know they're about down here somewhere. I just want to make sure they don't just walk around and attack the city. But no, let's gather you guys together. There, there, and there. And then do I have enough movement to hit this guy? I'm a little worried. But I think with proper positioning, we should be okay. So, let's kind of push in here. 1v1, I'm not that worried about a force, usually. Because I can oftentimes win through um, win through superior tactics and maneuvering. Um, and again, the artillery pieces aren't that bad. Like, if I can get into melee with them, they can't do a lot of damage. And it kind of tilts the balance of power in their favor if they have more than me. On the auto-resolve, at least. But it's not always... Uh, reflective of what's actually going to happen. So let's have you guys... Yeah, look at that. B balance power is way more in my favor now. Like, let's move you guys to about there. On limber, and then I will start advancing my infantry forward into little groups of three. So, like, you guys start moving on up over here. 
A lot better terrain this time than what we had last time. So you guys kind of go there. There. You guys kind of go right there. These guys. Let's see. I'll have you three. They are kind of all spread out. Let's go just about there. You guys about here. And then I've got two more here. So start advancing on up, guys. Spread on out. Let the enemy think, try and see what they can do to hit us. But we should be able to just rush on in and get in melee with these guys. Jesus, some of the artillery pieces they have are a lot stronger than the ones I've got. Because right now, they've already knocked out one of my units. One of my units is already running like a little bitch. So that's great. That's absolutely great. Um, we are almost right next to one of those machine gun units up there. Just might be able to take them on out. You guys are starting to enter into combat. Um, you guys here need to kind of line up like so and help out those units. Oh, actually, they have those, those cab units. Oh, no, they're breaking. Never mind. Yeah, run over here. Help with those infantry units. They have, like, nobody over here. So we can just keep advancing straight on up this way without any real resistance. So kind of just try and use this uh, building as cover, too. Try and make your way on over this way. At the moment, bounce power is still in my favor at the moment. The true fight is starting to begin around here. If you guys... I hope you guys don't just get mowed down by the machine guns. You might, as I try and get you guys over here to get rid of that unit. Because if you guys can get rid of that unit, then we can start properly surrounding these guys. It's like this unit, you need to adjust that. Let's have one of you uh, there, and one of you yeah, right there. Come on, the machine guns going to start opening up on us, or not yet? So far, they're not. Come on, you guys gonna open fire on them? Right about there you should. Yeah, there's only 12 of them, so they'll die. But they can do a lot of damage they can actually get set up properly, which they haven't been able to. Good. Okay, so then, what we do is those guys are now dead. Let's bring you guys around this way. Those guys are breaking. These guys, I'm gonna move you up a little bit closer. Right there. You guys are trying to get to their artillery pieces, so you're trying to go up this way. You need to go there. These guys are breaking, breaking, breaking. Good. So you guys can start hitting that unit. Focus them down. They've got all of their guys right around to you now. Okay, this is where the kill box begins. We've surrounded them. These guys should start dying. Okay, I've almost got them fully surrounded here. Um, you guys are almost into position where you can try and hit their artillery pieces. Just kind of line up about, I'd say, there. Because then you're going to be in line with these guys. Almost there. Just a little bit more. Because our kill boxes are doing exactly what we need right now. Disrupting their forces and slaughtering them. So that guy's holding, holding, holding. A lot of them are breaking. They haven't tried to send in their cab just yet, which they think they should, honestly. I think it's about all their infantry, actually. These guys are still kind of holding. You guys are starting to open up on the cab. Good. Uh, these guys. I'm going to start moving you guys up a little bit more to about there. You guys... Uh, at least just rotate. Rotate a little bit more. Those guys are all broken. Uh, this cab unit is just staying in front of you. Please open fire on them, please! Uh, you guys can't hit them from there properly, can you? No, nope, you can't. Move on up a little bit then. You guys, same thing. Move on up a little bit. These guys Glorious here. Victories, huh? yeah, so you guys can hit them from there. Good. I can move you guys up a little bit closer, though. Because they've just got these units left and, like, this one cab unit over here. For the most part... Wait, they've got somebody one in the back here? Units has used all its you? Huh? Oh, that was just one unit I forgot about. It. You're, just, you're just about dead. I'm not going to worry about you. And then I think it's just this guy? Yeah, that's it. There we go. So there goes a, another force of Italy. Now I just need you guys to kind of try and replenish here. And we're going to start making our way over to Valen uh, Venezia. I mean, I hope I can maybe get another piece of artillery, though, before I do. Maybe another artillery piece or two. Maybe. Because we did a decent amount of damage to them, but we also took a decent amount of damage ourselves. We'd lost uh, 1,200 guys. Oh, man. Lost so many dudes. And then you don't have enough movement to go chase them, sadly, but that's okay. Um, let's have you start getting the railroads here. And then I don't have enough money for another one, but I only have, like... Okay, I've got three other areas I can build them in. So, hold off on that. Don't build anything more. And then, research-wise, let me double-check that. I want to make sure you guys are getting the right thing. Yeah, because I need the more public order there. Um, I should make sure I get... I'm probably going to get this next, so that I can get the upgraded... Um, I can upgrade that building, and then unlock more stuff. 
Because this will give me... Ooh! Retrain and supply that stuff. More money. And then I should be able to get that too. Uh, patriotic fervor in home region. What's that do actually? Is that like melee, uh, more melee damage when we're in our own region? Ooh, diesel engines. Ooh. I'm gonna get, okay, so after this, I'm gonna get that. Because that just gives more three three uh, three wealth per turn um, from industry in the region. Also enables the building of the third railroad type. Um, is there a fourth one or is it just the third? It might be just the third. Also, where is... I'm still curious where the stuff is for tanks. Because I desperately need tanks. Telephones. Ooh, culture all happiness. That's something I need. Enables artillery barrage. Ooh. Oh, I don't like that. Minus two. Ouch. I'm just curious where the tank stuff actually is. Because I want to get to that as soon as possible. Mobile warfare. Nope, still not. <laughs> I can get more cavalry, yeah! Uh, infiltration tactics, anti-armor. Okay, there's anti-armor, so if there's anti-armor at this point, there's gotta be armor. Where's the armor? Submarine. F oh, flamethrower corpse. Ooh. Sniping tactics, trench warfare, Michigan corpse, heavy mortar. Yeah, where is that? Where is the tank stuff? Because I would not expect it to be under civil. I'd expect it to be under military. Strange. Because I know last time I was able to play this, I never got to the... I never got to tanks. Like, I used a lot of infantry and artillery, but I never got to tanks. And I want to get to tanks. Barrage. There, there's gas weapons. Where are tanks? Where are my tanks at? Because there's anti-tank snipers there. I can see that right there. But where are tanks? Because this is all aerial down this one most of the time. Cavalry modernization. Weird. I would expect it to be over here possibly too. Because diesel engines. Motorized field ambulances. Like, it's got to be getting there. Synthetic materials. Strange. Okay, well, we'll try and keep that in mind as we're going through here, as I need tanks desperately. Right now, me focusing on solely just infantry art and artillery is not the worst, but it does mean we are going to have so many casualties. <laughs> oh, so many casualties everywhere. So that'll make things interesting as we try and push into people. Uh, basically, right now, that force north of Zagreb, they're gonna kill the army of. Oh, they just fucking peered. Did they wait? Did they teleport all the way over there? Or no, they're over there. Okay, sorry, they're by Budapest. Um, I might have a smaller army go deal with them, cause I don't want to have my large army focus on them. I think I actually want those guys to start making their way to Venezia right now. And then is Serbia going to attack us? I'm debating. I'm wondering if they're going to make their way over to us, or am I gonna have to go advance on that army? I, oh, 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 I got an opportunity to intercept. Uh, just slaughter these poor fools. I lost 600, not bad for that. That way I can just do a battle on against you there. Oh, another researcher, nice. I desperately need that. So uh, do just add in more research so we can kind of have some massive amounts of research around here. And then, let's see, you guys have... Basically, what I want to try and do is I'll try and get that. So I'll recruit all those guys. They will try and deal with you, as I would much rather not waste my time trying to go over and get you. And I would rather make my way on over and try and hit your city. I think that's a better use of my time than waiting around for you guys. I should be okay. If they make their way over to the city, I'll done kill them. But I'm gonna give them the chance for that. You guys here, let's see. Yeah, that's a decent amount of damage. You guys did not lose that much either here. Nice. Yeah, let's just try and finish them off here. Because then this army can push forward. You guys can just slaughter them. Finish those guys off. And now is Serbia happy? No! Damn it! It's so fucking close! Like, if I exempt them from tax, they are. So I can do that for a little bit. I then can move this army out. 
I'm bringing you on over. You're going to make your way on over and help out with Italy. So start getting all of these upgrades. Here. Actually, you can go kill that army. You can go kill that force, but make your way on over this way. And now we can properly start trying to focus on Italy. Because what we'll try and do is I'll keep bringing you over west, see what they're going to do with this force. I would like to bring you back down here, pick up you with this force, and then hit Naples. That's what I'd love to do with this army. But if this army is going to be very aggressive, I think I'll use you to kill them off first. We'll do that. Also, Russia's still doing nothing. I'm glad. I'm really happy that you guys aren't doing anything right now. But I kind of feel a little awkward that you guys aren't as well. Because I feel like you guys should have tried to attack me by this point right now. Or maybe they just realized, nah, let's let them ha fight Italy. Sure, weaken Italy for us so we can just mop up you and then Italy at the same time. I have no idea, but Russia is just sitting there as a giant menace. Like, what are you going to do? Are you going to invade me? Are you just going to walk in? What are you going to do, guys? I don't know. Okay, so that force is making its way up towards Hungary. I do not like that. No, I do not. So I think I'm going to... Are you guys happy with that? I'm in here? Yes. Uh, start making your way over towards Austria. I'm going to start making my way on over there. This force here. Also start trying to make your way on over there. We'll see what they do. You guys again. I'm going to keep checking every once in a while. <gasps> I can exempt them from tax right now. Oh, awesome. Okay, do that. Because that's another 500 per turn right now. And we'll keep it. You guys here... Slowly replenishing. Um, trying to see where their border starts. Okay, it's right there. So I can keep pushing up to about here. Still get some more replenishment. As I desperately still need that. You guys keep making your way on up that way. And then let's make sure that infrastructure is being built up everywhere. Because I know there's... Yeah, you, you can still get another one. And you as well. And that's all of my railroads. Now, can you guys recruit anybody that takes one turn? Ah, no. Of course not. I think I am going to maybe try... Yeah, let's try and recruit some of these guys. Try and recruit those guys. See if we can prevent them from attacking our city. Oh, I said power just through relativity. Oh, nice. Um, and that was a light howitzer there. Nice. Um, and Silveries? Judge and decorated hero. Nice. Yeah, you, de you definitely deserve it. Um, I'm going to have you guys again. Let's try and get... We need to start getting more artillery pieces, so I will have you start recruiting some more there. Let's do one more end turn, see what's kind of going on. I'm hoping that Italy does not try and attack Budapest. I'm going to hope you guys don't. Because I've got just the garrison there, and they will probably die to you. I'm going to hope they give me time to get my forces over and repel them. Oh, they're next to the city, but they didn't attack it. Thank you! I have some time. I have some time. Because then, my force up there, um, I think their artillery is practically all dead in that army. So I can take that force that was east of Vienna. They can deal with them. This force down here, you... Uh, path blocked? Who's that? Why? Uh, try and make your way over there. And I'm trying to remember if it's the start or end of the turn, but you guys should be able to get some more troops around here. This guy... Yeah, make your way back over down here. Make your way over to those ships. As I'm going to have you go for Naples. That's what I want you to try and go do. You can try and make your way on over there. And then I need my plane here, good sir. Um, please go scout out what's going on in the city of Venezia. There is not much around here. And you were successful. So, right now. Ooh. So I can see you there. You've been able to replenish a decent amount. I think what we'll do is next video, you're going to attack this army, lure them out, kill them all, and then I think what we'll actually do is I don't know if I'm going to push in and hold the city based on this force here. Depends on how much, how much damage we take. I might pull back further and actually let them reclaim it, possibly. Research-wise, also, stop that shit. Stop researching that, please. Actually, switch over this, because if I can get this, I can upgrade all of my airfield stuff. That'll give me a bit more money. Um, and then you guys are getting mass production. Stop that. Get the diesel engines. Oh, no. no. You go that one. You go for the diesel engines. That's what I want you guys to research. Focus on that. Um, that gives more population growth. Ooh, nice. But no. I think this is going to be a pretty good place to end this video for now. Had a bit of a struggle in the beginning with Russia, but thankfully they've left me alone for now. And... We are on the attack with Italy. 
I should be able to take Venezia. It's just whether or not we're going to want to kind of hold there for now. Because this army I'm a little worried about. Because if we take too much damage, they could kill our force here. Because we are still a little beat up. So it depends on how well this battle goes if we're going to try and hold the city. Because they're probably going to rebel. That's going to be something we are going to have to worry about. But I'm going to end this video for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys did, let me know down in the comments down below. I love hearing what you guys have to say about this campaign and any thoughts you have on it in general. So I'm going to hope you guys enjoyed this. But this is Rampant, and I'll see you guys next time.